Welcome back to episode 47 of this Napoleonic Total War 3 1805 campaign playing as the Empire of France. Uh, right, so quick, very quick summary of where we are. On the western flank there's two Ottoman armies heading somewhere. They bypassed the Iberian Peninsula completely so you've got to think they're heading for me. Um, I have a very limited Oh, I can do that. I've got just about enough money to do that, actually. <laughs> uh, so who we got? Jean Len. Lenay. Len. Uh, yeah, I think we'll go for you. Right, so they now have a general. So, um, very short on artillery and, well, they're short on everything, really, but if nothing else, they should be able to give these boys a bloody nose. If you can't defeat them and send them running back into the sea. Uh, so that's the western flank. Nothing occurring on this in the south here, on the south of France. Um, pontifical states are just sitting there, not doing anything especially. Yeah, you know, I've done them. Uh, on the eastern border, as with Prussia, I'm. I'm Referring to being proactive here, I'm not really a fan of this especially, but oh actually that makes life interesting as well. Um, there is this Austrian army. Can't reach, uh, what was that, Zagreb. Can reach Vienna. I can't reach them with them. I can with them. Ooh, dear. I was going to wait to see where they went, because oh, they can reach Vienna but nowhere else. But they're a pest, because they can come and support them if they assault Vienna. Or they can go for Olmutz. Hmm. Monsieur. Prêt à recevoir vos ordres? <sighs> It's tempting. I'm trying to save Masena's army for the assault on um, Hungary, on uh, Budapest. Because if I leave it another turn, then they'll just keep building their forces up, and I really don't want that. But I can't move Masena because then he could bypass and go south, and I've... Oh, I do have an army down here, actually, don't I? That's a plan. There you go. Fast up. So I can move Hairdo, Marat, up um, to respond to anything if Teshin goes south. So I could I could assault Budapest. Ooh. Actually, let's do that. That was a change of plan. <laughs> I wasn't expecting to do that. Oh dear. But they're all militia. They're all militia. Some skirmishers, some lights, some line lights, a couple of light cav, lancers, no general. Okay, so heavy on their numbers but low grade. A thousand more men than me, but mine are better quality. Right, let's just continue the season. I'll do that in a sec, actually. Um, the Prussian garrison in Breslau can't reach anywhere. They can reach Dresden and take out my allies, but I can't support them. I've got enough on my plate already as it is in Brandenburg. So um, I've concentrated a force of war units onto the bridge to defend, just in case this um, von Henry von Essen's Swedish army decides to sally. I can't go into Mecklenburg because I'm a, not at war with them. Um, I have another army following up in support here under Straub. There's um, a couple of light foot catching up with him. So they will be available for operations around here um, next turn. I've Monsieur. popped a couple of Straub's cavalry on this bridge just in case Blue should just decide to be bloody annoying. Um, well he's got some movement on him, hasn't he? 
don't think he can do any damage to me other than... Yeah, there's a garrison in there. Yeah, so I popped a couple of cab on there just to make, make life difficult for him, really. And um, if he's still hanging around next turn, I'll, I'll grab him with him. Can't quite get to him this turn. Um, May is now in command of the army besieging Berlin because his um, storage is high up. Let's just see. Deploy second good. So the idea was to put Ney in there with higher um, experience so I could deploy second, which is working. There's a support army there to provide reinforcements if it starts turning into a bit of a bloodbath. Napoleon's army is resting and reforming up here in Stettin. He could be under threat from half a dozen individual units and three slightly worn units there, but between them they can handle them, so that's alright. Even if Blucher joins in, yep, yeah, don't care. They can't reach to support, so that's all good. So, I think in this term I was I was going to just leave them resting and, and replenishing. And unexpectedly, I think I'm going to do this now. Not to. So, um, outnumbered, but I've got better quality troops than them, so yeah, that's alright. If I can take this line out of the top first, that'll do nicely. Um, so, Messina. Plenty of experience. He's been a busy lad in the south in Vienna, defending Vienna ferociously. <laughs> right, um, I'll get set up anyway. So, at the uh, top right corner, I had the opportunity to deploy in an L. Um, that's the traditional position facing them there. So I've gone up here. So um, I'm hoping to attack them entirely on the flank. Uh, that's the one I want, isn't it? So let's see if I can do that. Have to support my boys. Will they advance? Get in a position. See how far forward they can get before. Yourself in square leg. Yeah, can you run, please? Sure, I told you to bugger off out of the square now. Come on. Right, that's good. to see what I want. Have a decent field of fire there. Uh, you 
can take them. And if you would just stop. Have you stopped yet? Thank you. You can add to the fire. Probably hidden in the crest. These ones certainly are, deliberately. They're about to fold. Are you sure they can blast them with some uh, canister? Good job. City, isn't it? So I haven't got to be overly concerned by right, advance to the next line, gentlemen. Those guards support the lights because they're a precarious position with those lancers lurking in the undergrowth. I'm not a damage to him, considering. Oh, actually, 
me, hold on, you wait until, <laughs> wait until I've cleared. <laughs> What's that? Oh, this little dude run off by himself to have a nose. Good. Who are they? Make sure I'm not overly concerned about them. We're peeling them back, boys, bit by bit. Okay. Oh, uh, we'll have them, actually. Yep. I'll see my answers. I'm sure I saw my answers. Right, and there's the second half of the army. We've got a pretty good range. What's his field of view? Field of fire. And here comes the rain. Yeah. Just be limber up. You're not doing a lot of good there. on the hill please do 
who's coming over there? Excuse me. Must be a sweet nothings in your ear. Uh, how far is the Abusio's range? So he's come to the end of his limit, really. Which is annoying. The lights have cleared out. And have become far too exposed. Shit. That's alright, they're peeling off. No, they're not. Dragons, go and help them out please. I've made a silly mistake. that. You can advance to the edge of the wood. the day over there. And you can just go fucking knock yourself out there boys. Yeah, stand a fair chance against militia. Especially when they're winded. Alright, so... They're beating them. Ooh. We have chaps who aren't happy about their arrival. Got them pulled apart really. Their strongest concentration is over there, so perhaps I should move this brigade to support their efforts. Mm. Bit of that. Where's my drag? Oh, there they are. I can see them for bloody nothing. Get you guys out of there because you're starting to take losses and you're feeling a bit sorry for yourself.
Ooh, there's an opportunity. Unless they're after the guns. Which is possible. How are we getting on? So, oh, I haven't bloody moved them, did I? Silly bugger. Got sidetracked. Okay, so... Can't get in the field of fire anywhere, really. the good unit, the one I just charmed must have destroyed them, okay, cool. Things happen to him. What? But there's I <laughs> don't get that. Why do they fall over themselves and break a bloody gun going over the ramp? Come on. Apparently they did. So, Malaysia. I keep forgetting about my horse all the way over there and there. Okay, so I need to start thinking about digging them with ease, don't I? Really? Sir! Sir! Our general is under attack! Is it? I was chasing them. 
Oh, that's nice. They've rejoined. Good grief. <laughs> well, live and learn. I didn't know they did that. They fall over their own guns. A glorious victory, sir, is soon to be yours. Yeah. Right, so I have Where's my other cavalry. Finish them off, they're boring. line waiting for these two. Oh, we've got a Grenz. Okay, yep, yeah, cool. And we decide to deploy them into line. Excellent. So we get them over there. These boys can wait. That will draw those two back onto the right half of the army. Three, can wheel round. Bring you into the line, and I think we're ready. Okay. Oh, artillery. I thought it was horse artillery, artillery for some reason. Four. Good, so they're all knackered because they've been chasing my cavalry around. The line has exploded into life, that's good. position. Come on, last one. Get in there quickly boys, quickly. Good, and Limber Canister should be just in time to greet your new friends. Good. 
We are a good to go, as they say. Some cavalry on them. One can fire from my Voltigo. Give me more poison, that's enough now. How are we getting on over here? They're gone. them. Play that charge on them. Are they going into square? Is that what that is? Should be the end of them. You've got a nice clear line on them. done over there? Yep, they're all broken, so it's just these ones. Send that brigade to soften them up. They're exhausted, so even though they massively outnumber them, I'm only winded, and that should, hopefully, be enough. That flank done, done, done. Three units over here, four units over here. They're about to be engaged and will presumably break. feel quite happy. All done. Come on. 
don't think so. Wait, please. It's still militia. So you wouldn't think it would be that difficult to finish them off. It's only a unit of dragoons, but nevertheless they are almost gods. We do it. Oh, they're fresh. Excellent. Right. The second they're freed up, they're going to move into Charles Roseburgers. They are done. Boys, you know, oh, there we go. That's got to be it now. Come on. They've disappeared off the board, off the map. Um, right, I'll check out if these are militia units, and I don't need to chase them down. If they're not, then I'll destroy every last one of them if I can. So, back in a sec. I'll take that. 700 down, but um, Budapest done. So. do if I liberate it it's going to be susceptible to counter attacks but they provide their own army so let's liberate them Ooh, welcome to the world agree okay so that was an unexpected bonus There was an army there, wasn't there? That was the point of me doing this. Where's the Austrian army gone? Oh! <laughs> they really don't like me, do they? <laughs> okay, don't understand that. Presumably that army was somehow linked to... Hungary, and as a result, it's I don't know been disbanded or something. Okay, don't mind that. Right, so we have a protectorate in Hungary, they're a kind of a buffer, great big area. Um, two regions left for Austria, so they're basically done, really, aren't they? They're still there, but they're done. Um, so I've got 21 of the 22 regions, Brandenburg, Berlin is the one under siege, so that's the last of the victory objectives for this campaign. So if I do that, that clears the victory objectives, and then I guess decide whether to continue or not. Hmm. Fabulous. Okay, well that was a bit weird. Excellent. All right. So, um, yeah. Well, I guess that's that episode done. So, um, with one victory objective left up in the north, fabulous city of Berlin, which is smoking like a kipper at the minute. Uh, we'll come back next time to see what, if anything, to do about that. Nice one. All right. I'll see you next time. Ta-da.